Hello, respected people, and welcome back to Respected Minister. Don't forget to subscribe the channel before starting the video. Pauline Hansen tweeted, The Albanese Labour government has let our immigration system collapse. This is what happens when incompetent fools are left in charge of immigration, border control, and national security. From the Australian, Home Affairs Minister Claire O'Neill has conceded the government has lost control of key aspects of Australia's migration laws in the wake of the immigration detention crisis, amid rising concerns over an avalanche of judicial rulings. Loressa, Pauline, Labour have increased our CO2 emissions by letting in more immigrants. If our population does a lot of strenuous exercise, CO2 goes up eight times. So no running or any physical exerting exercise by Australians to bring down CO2 emissions. Ponder more. It is under complete control and going swimmingly as planned. It's like oops. Shucks, sorry everyone for changing the rest of eternity in Australia. It was totally just this one lady's fault. It's a supply issue. Giles and O'Neill must step down or be removed from office immediately. Their consistent and ongoing failures have made their positions untenable. Dr. Hans Gruber. This was all on purpose though. Labor are mass immigration extremists. They just want more bodies crammed into the country. It's a core part of their decrepit and maladaptive ideology. Andy Fraser. The Gov needs to regain control with what is still under their power that is reject the maximum number of offshore visa applications. The onshore applications can be overruled by the court when appealing, Gov lost control over it. Stop approving visas. Julie Masters. Stop concentrating on that. It's the reckless record high surge of demand fueling the absolute crisis all renters are enduring. One obscene rent hike after another due to demand fed REIND slash LL market leverage minus 0.7% RVR and still record high surge of demand highest ever in Jan. Sway with me. Love your work, Pauline, but maybe selling the solution is paramount. What would one nation do? The LMP slash Labour are two sides of the same coin, we need a new start, and the corporate Australian Labour government has to go and ownership return to all Australians. That concludes our analysis of the Twitter exchange. Share your opinions in the comments below. If you found this video insightful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your fellow political enthusiasts, and subscribe for more in-depth discussions on Australians' politics. Thanks for being with us on Respected Minister and we'll catch you in the next video. Stay engaged and stay informed.